Hey guys, Lene Monet here and I am back with another video. All right guys, so today we're going to be making some Obey Honey Hot Wings. Now, if this your thing, then come hang with a queen, all right? We're about to get right into the video. Look, I already washed my hands off camera because right now, you know what it is? I like to get straight into it, okay? Without further ado, let's get straight into it. We're going to start with our wings. I have already washed them. I already dried them because you don't want too much water in them. So you have to pat them dry. And now we're going to season these bad boys up. I'm using some seasoned salt. Some, what is this? Garlic powder. Oh, yeah. A little bit of garlic powder or whatever. Onion powder. But however you season your chicken, do you. Please, by all means, baby. I love that. Some pepper. Some paprika. For color. Because we got to get it looking a little bit kind of cute, girl. Let me be dazzle you a little bit. Let me get a little shine on you. Gonna mix this up. Make sure we season both sides. Because we eat both sides. Okay, it's only right. It's only right. Right beside me, I have my um deep fryer at 375. Because the best way to get the nice, crispy, fried, hard chicken is to have your grease hot. Okay? Um, What I'm not going to do, I'm not going to put any flour on here. No flour. I'm going to go ahead and fry these things up naked. Okay. In their birthday suit. That's how we're going to do that. Then we're going to drench it in that good old honey obey hot sauce that I'm about to show y'all how to make as well while we wait for this thing to get it popping. Okay. So they should be pretty much coated like this. We're going to let them sit and then we're going to drop them babies. All right, sis. Our deep fryer is preheated to 375. We're just going to take our wings like this. Put them things right there. Try not to over overcrowd your deep fryer. And drop it. Drop it, drop it low, girl. Drop it, drop it low, girl. You're going to let these go for about eight minutes. It depends on how hard you like your chicken fried though. So it's all personal preference. I let mine go for about eight minutes though. So let's go ahead and get started on our sauce. I'm gonna use a half a stick of butter. Go and plop that thing up in, oh girl, get up in there now. Get in there. Yeah, yeah. All right, girl, there you go. You too, you get in there as well. Put your heat on about a medium and let this melt. All right, I know y'all hear that chicken over there sizzling. It's sizzling. And our butter is melting. So while it's doing its thing, let's go ahead. And now let me tell you this. Let me show you this. Let me show you this. Hold on. I'm going to put a half a cup. Let me show you what I got. Let me show you what I got, okay? I'm going to put a half a cup of this Old Bay hot sauce, baby. You need that. That's what I knew, and that's what I had knew. You was missing that your whole life. And look at, look at God just sending me your way to let you know what's happening, okay? I'm going to put a little bit of Frank's Red Hot as well in here. Not too much, but enough, you know, because you still wanted to have that hot wing feel. You know what I mean? And some garlic powder, some onion powder, some crushed red peppers, pepper flakes. Crushed red pepper flakes, okay? Smoked paprika. Yeah, girl. I said it. I did. You can use smoked paprika too, which may be actually better. And then I want to use this. Uh, I never use this seasoning, but um, it's called Flavor God. And he got a hot wing seasoning. I mean, don't it sound right? Sound like something you should go and put up in there like that. going to get us some honey and drizzle that baby up in there. Woo! Oh, yeah. You already know it's fire. I know your mouth is watering by now. Gotta be. Mine's is, and I'm right here. Mmm. Ooh, this smells so good, y'all. Ooh, it smells so bomb. Ooh, that tastes so good. What do I want to add? I want to add a little bit more honey. Just a little bit. Baby, it's the sauce for me. It's the sauce for me. Do you see me out here whipping swiftly? I don't care. I'm a cook anywhere. Hello. Get into it. 
Yeah. So all you're going to do is put this on a low simmer so those flavors can continue to what? Get to know each other. You right. You got it. Let's go check on these wings. All right. Let's check these things out. Woo. Yeah, buddy. Rolling like a big shot. So you want to go ahead, and get you a cooling rack or put it on paper towel. I just found when I put it on a cooling rack, they're a lot crispier. So you want to go ahead and put it on a cooling rack and let them cool for a little bit. Then drop your second batch. Like we're about to do right now. Now you want to take your sauce. This delicious sauce we just made, my God. Get you a bowl or something and pour all that delicious goodness up in there like that. Ooh, my God, my God. Then you're going to take your chicken and put them things up in there. Hey, put them up in there. Put them up in there. Put them up in there. Hey, put them up. I put them up. I put them up. Put them up. Put them up in there. So, boom. And then you're just going to give it a nice little... Ooh, baby. Give it a nice little toast. Mmm. Mmm. If y'all could only smell... If you only could really smell what The Rock was cooking. Now I know what he was talking about. Do you smell it? Do you smell it? Look. Look at it. My God. Let me play these up. Let me play them up and so you can get into it how I'm getting into it. Okay? Oh, yeah. That's how y'all feel. Get into these honey old bay hot wings, baby, with some ranch in the middle. Oh, when I tell you it's packed with flavor, <laughs> when you taste it, don't say I ain't tell you so, okay? Get into it, yum. <laughs> you already know what time it is. Hey, <laughs> yes, oh, yes. Come on now, bow it. Amen. Amen. And guess what? We're not going to waste no more time. All right? I want a small one, y'all, because I am not hungry. Let me tell you what I did. I had a big lunch. Big lunch, okay? And I destroyed my appetite. But I'm going to tear these up tomorrow, though. No wing left behind. Okay? We're going to eat these tomorrow for lunch. So I don't have to keep doing that to myself because that wasn't nice. All right. We're going to take this very baby little... A little stinker butt. Hey, girl. Oh, let's taste it without the uh, ranch. And it's so juicy. Just as juicy as it want to be. Y'all, this was quick and easy. Quick and easy. You can't beat it. You really can't beat it. I'm going to say that right now. Mm, 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 mm. Y'all know I don't be leaving no meat on that bone. Ooh, that thing. Mmm. Mmm. What? Because I know you lying. I know you lying. Tasting like how you tasting. Double cheeked up on a Wednesday afternoon. Excuse me. Ooh, yeah, y'all. Now, I know some of y'all probably was looking for me on Sunday. I just got back in town, guys. I had to take a little mental break. And so, I just had to get away real quick. Just free my mind. Free your mind! Okay? Real quick. But y'all know I love to cook. And so, you know, that fast food can wait. Let's be honest. You know, the people love the fast food. But if it come down to me cooking myself a home-cooked meal after finally getting back in town or going straight to eating fast food, you better believe I'm going to hit the kitchen. So, that's why I'm here today. And that's what I think I've been talking to you guys about is self-care and taking care of yourself. Because when I be talking to y'all, I be preaching to myself too. Like, I really do. Because I know that sometimes, I know that sometimes that can get neglected. So, if you got to take some days to yourself, if you got to drop the kids off at, I don't know, I, I don't, at the corner store for two seconds. It's like, no, I don't drop them off at the corner store. This say I said it. Lord, please don't do that. I was just playing. Please don't do that. But if you got to drop them off at cousin, auntie, grandma, somebody house for a minute so that you can clear your mind, 
it is imperative that you do so because if you continue to just go and go and go and go and go and go, it's going to start to feel like work and not like your destiny. All right. So pay attention to that. If you like this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Also hit that notification bell so you'll know every time I upload. Until next time, guys. Peace.